Hi everyone, let's make a start. First step is applying a highly pigmented white eyeshadow base to lids. For bright colorful looks, my go-to product is the NYX Cosmetics Eyeshadow Base in White. Now using the stunning rainbow eyeshadow palette from Ingvard, I'm working from light to dark. Selecting the lightest blue eyeshadow in the pan, I'm creating a gradient of color on my eyelids, starting with this shade on my inner corners. Now for the medium blue eyeshadow. This goes next to the light blue color on the center of my eyelids. It's time for the deepest blue shade in the pan. This color transfers onto my outer corners. Onto the smoky gray black shade. Using the same principle, I'm starting from light to dark, picking up this light grey shadow and patting it onto the outermost corners of my eyes. Now because we're working with much darker shadows, we want to blend flawlessly before moving on to the next shadow. Switching it up, I'm skipping the mid-tone grey shadow and going straight to the charcoal black colour above. Then, very gently, pressing the dark colour into my crease area, this will push the eye socket back, creating a striking dramatic edge. Next, rim a black gel liner onto your upper lash line. Then ground eyeshadow shades by dusting light brown copper shadows into your crease area. Give your eyes an instant lift with a highlighting powder placed neatly under your brows. Curl those lashes and wrap up eye makeup with the blackest of black mascara. For blush, use a complementary color to blue. You can never go wrong with peachy pink. Finish the look with a girly, glossy pink lipstick. And that's it. Now that's how you pull up blue eyeshadow, honey. Thanks for watching Art Meets Makeup TV. Bye! Music East Ender